Hi there, Navad Mirons. It's Borja, your fellow hiking enthusiast, back for another cerebral trek. We're venturing into a mystery that has baffled investigators, scientists, and fellow hikers like me for over six decades. The hunting Dyatlov Pass incident of 1959. Are you ready to explore how the lens of modern AI, particularly anomaly detection, could possibly shed light on this icy enigma? Strap on your metaphorical hiking boots and let's get going. Part 1. The Dialove Pass Incident The Mystery Deepens Picture this, a frigid, moonlit night in the remote Ural Mountains of Russia. The year is 1959, and nine hikers, young and brimming with life, embark on an expedition they believe will be the adventure of a lifetime. Igor Dialov, their leader, is an experienced mountaineer who had meticulously planned the trek to reach Otorten Mountain. Little did they know, it would be their last. Weeks later, a search party stumbles upon a spine-chilling scene. The camp is in disarray, the tents torn open from the inside, as if the occupants were fleeing an unimaginable terror. Their bodies are found scattered across the snow-covered landscape, miles away from their camp, and in various states of undress, some wearing only their underwear despite sub-zero temperatures. The autopsies only deepen the mystery, unexplained skull fractures, multiple broken ribs, internal injuries with no external marks, and most disturbingly, one hiker missing her tongue. Elevated radiation levels detected on their clothing further muddle the enigma, leading some to speculate about military testing or even extraterrestrial involvement. To this day, each discovered clue seems to raise more questions than answers. Whispered theories abound, from secret Soviet military experiments to cryptid encounters, but none can explain the myriad inexplicable details. Part 2, Unlocking the Ice Cold Case with AI and Anomaly Detection Let's talk about anomaly detection, an AI technology that specializes in identifying patterns and outliers in data that deviate from what is standard or expected. But how does this actually work? At its core, an anomaly detection system is trained on a set of normal data. Once it learns what normal looks like, it's ready to flag anything that deviates from this pattern as an anomaly. Imagine this as a hyper-observant sentinel that never sleeps. It continuously scans various data streams, be it temperature, radiation levels, weather patterns, or even sounds. The moment something odd occurs, say an abrupt drop in temperature or a sudden increase in radiation, the system would immediately alert the relevant people or systems. So, how could this apply to the Dialove Pass incident? Picture the hikers equipped with wearable IoT, Internet of Things, devices, networked with an AI-driven anomaly detection system. These wearables could monitor heart rates, body temperatures, and environmental factors like the weather and radiation. The moment anything anomalous occurs, like a sudden drop in a hiker's body temperature or an unexpected rise in environmental radiation, the system would send out an immediate alert, urging the team to take immediate action. The same system could monitor seismic activities or other environmental factors, which are usually out of human perception range but could be life-threatening. A sudden radiation spike, inexplicable temperature changes, or abnormal seismic activities could have possibly triggered an immediate alarm, allowing the hikers to take preventive measures, thereby altering the course of events. And there you have it, nomadic neurons. A compelling journey into the enigmatic Dyatlov Pass and the futuristic promise of anomaly detection. Imagine how many mysteries we could potentially unravel and life safe by marrying history with cutting-edge technology. If this frosty tale mingled with modern tech throws you as much as it does me, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe for more cerebral adventures. Until next time, keep those neurons firing and stay forever curious. Catch you in the next video.